Hello everyone and welcome to the Bridgewater International Poetry Festival of 2020. It's so exciting to be uh, visiting you virtually and uh, sharing some of my work with you. Uh, my name is Ed Wade and I am coming to you from Hanoi, Vietnam. And I'd like to read to you um, one piece from my book that was published last year, the Misana B. Joke Book um, from Uncollected Press. And this one is actually called Hanoi, Ode to the Che Cho. Um, and in it, I apologize to Carl Sandburg because I just kind of took his poem, Chicago, and kind of took that grittiness that he saw in Chicago and tried to um, work it into the images and sights and sounds of Hanoi. Um, so I hope you like it. Hanoi, Ode to the Che Chiu. Apologies to Carl Sandburg. Dog butcher to the Orient, glass crusher, horn blower, 1070 CE, Van Mio willed the temple of literature into existence, spit skinny, loading tuk lao, bong loads of stale tobacco, 10% body fat. You ask about the war, but you have to specify Cambodia, USA, France, China, Japan, take your pickistan. And they tell me the old women haul carts. Yes, it's true, I've seen them tame field beefs with waving fingers and beetle blackened teeth. And they tell me the old men are still scraping ancient orange from out beneath their fingernails. It's true. And the girls wear lipstick like vampires and bite like vampires and party like vampires in heat. It's true. Come and show me another city so dank and soaked with blood and proud to wear their ghosts like sergeant stripes. The young buffalo, Che Chiao, the young boys pool sharking and playing cards until their fingerprints wear down to the bone. Here is the Vietnam of the ghosts, unlike the South who ran to McDonald's and hid in the bathroom. Fiery as the dog on the spit, fierce as the scorpions in the rice wine, Venomous as the cobras in the zeal. Heads shaved, wrecking motorbikes atop wrecked motorbikes, tattooing antiquity on their forehead. Building, breaking, rebuilding. Under the masks there are laughs, mocking the atmospheric pollutants, mocking the 6th National Congress of 1986. Under the terrible burden of destiny, laughing as a young man laughs, bragging and laughing, that under his tattoo is the pulse, and under his ribs is the heart of the people laughing. The wheeze of the breath and the grit of the buildings crack like teeth, shoeless in the streets. Damn those rusted nails and serrated aluminum scraps. Proud to put your dog, crush glass, and ride the blaring rhino horns through their veins.